don't develop a one-track approach, otherwise man won't have enough room for expression to feel free. If man sees his chains, he will only want to break them. If we give men the feeling that they are free, I am convinced that they will exceed their limits. And it is only from that condition that humanity shall rise up. But do you want to dominate or raise humanity higher? I want it to advance. I want it to progress. Man is our vessel. If he progresses, then so do we. Wouldn't you like to know what we really are? Who do you mean? Demons? Yes, us. Our species. I've been searching for centuries, trying to find a way to explain the reason of our existence. But humanity has not yet evolved enough to make any progress on the subject. I am convinced that the sciences will bring that knowledge someday. So, that's your objective, is it? To understand who we are? I see your point. Our family clings to its privileges and to the past, and that's how they are putting us in danger. The time has come for change. Now that you know your true nature, there are still a few things I need to teach you. What do you mean exactly? A new skill, and not the least, Louis. It's about taking control of a person. Oh, good lord. I don't see how I could do that. I shall help you the first time. How do you do it? It's an anima resonance. How it works is still a bit unclear even to us. Like a wave or a sound? That seems the most likely, yes. In my opinion, demons are capable of tuning their psychic frequency to that of others. That is why, for example, I tend to surround myself with deaf and dumb servants. The servants dressed in black. I infiltrated them. I opened a channel between them and me and then I deprived them of speech and hearing. This way, no other demon can turn them against me. Which servant's wearing black? Okay, let's not waste any more time. <laughs> I deduce that you're impatient to master what's in store for you. That is good. I thought I'd mix business with pleasure for this first time. What do you mean by that? The conference will come to a close shortly, as you know. Not that I'm fed up with archaic diplomacy, but it's time to ensure the success of this project. To make this happen, I would like Piaget to inform the Pope he has changed signs. Here is my plan. I would like you to join his eminence in his room. Just play along. We'll see when the time comes. Very well. And then? You're going to have to trust me. What we're going to do is painless for the human you are going to invade. Invade? Yes. You're going to enter his mind and take control. You're going to influence his actions and his psyche. Make him speak, then concentrate. You must focus on him in order to feel his thoughts. Then, while speaking, you must link with him. Once you're done, you will naturally find your way to the source and enter into his thoughts. But what if I fail? Trust in your instincts. You just have to let yourself go. You have the skill. Let your nature come to the fore. You'll see. If you fail, you'll be in for some light banter with his eminence. That's all. There's nothing to be afraid of. Very well. Perfect. Go now. The Cardinal is in his room. You will have to write a letter to the Pope as if Piaggi had written it himself. In this letter, tell the Pope that whatever happens during the conference, he must follow my propositions. But be careful. In order to protect himself from counterfeiters, the Pope had Piaggi's hand tattooed with a symbol to be sure of his identity. You'll see when you're inside him. You'll understand. Once it's written up, just bring it back to me and I'll send it off immediately. All right, I'll take care of it. Okay. Strange. Interesting. Kind of gay. But, well, we'll go ahead and do it. <laughs> the whole entering inside of him thing. It's strange. Yet useful. Now, I don't remember where we left Piaggi. At the end of a hallway. See down the hallway, would be nice. Or where Piaggi's room is. Is there a map? Yes, there is. 
Oh, I'm heading kind of the right way. It's just on the opposite end of the building. Lame. Oh, well, I did not see you before. Very nice. So I need to get into his feelings, which is interesting. Where am I? I'm at Piaggi's room. <laughs> Very nice. I am brilliant. Ah, well, Louis, what brings you back to my chambers? May I sit down? Of course, Louis. Don't you feel good? Yes, but if I'm going to pass inside you, I'd better sit myself down first. It's nothing. Don't worry about it. Well, what can I do for you? Right. Now I need to concentrate. I wanted to speak to you, Your Eminence. I wanted to thank you for your help. I mean, for your time talking to me about the Holy Lance. Oh. And did you find it? It's the crusade of a lifetime for some people. You are searching for another Holy Grail. You're nearly there. Link into his thoughts. Does it annoy you at all? But what on earth is he trying to get at? Why do you ask, Louis? I don't follow. For the glory, Your Eminence. I can feel it coming. It's working. What? Insolence? Why? Really? I am a man of the church, Louis. May God keep me from such ambition. Right. Let me in, Your Eminence. Why? <gasps> I've done it. I've done it, damn it. He was right. This is just crazy. I can't believe it. Look at yourself, Louis. You better not get caught. Whoa. I still need to get used to this body. So, let's see about what Mortimer asked me. Right. Well, it's time I got started. Let's see what I can find here to help me write that letter. I have no means to validate my forgery, so I better take my time with and not make any mistakes. There are two letters from the Pope on the desk. I should be able to get a clue or two by checking how well they correspond to each other. And here are three stamps. All are different. Okay. My dear Giuseppe. Okay. Do not use your personal stamp when writing to me. Instead, use the one with my motto on it. What's the what's the motto? Okay. Uh, good trip. Okay. Give me a moment. Phone's going off. Okay, we're good. Um, put down the letters. Choose the contents. Right. Well, let's start writing. Lord Mortimer asked me to discredit Sir Gregory and to announce Piaggi's final vote in his favor. As an introduction, Your Holiness, thank you for your trust. I must discredit home. It turns out, now that I'm here, that I find Lord Mortimer's projects grant us many more advantages in comparison to what Sir Gregory had suggested. We are talking about the future of the Holy See. Hmm. There. That should be enough to justify the change of vote. Okay, I can't really see this over here. Wish I could other oh, write the code. Okay, write a secret code. There's a kind of code composed of six letters that they always write under the dates of their correspondence. According to Mortimer, it's got something to do with Piaggi's tattoo. I guess I'll have to write one for today's date. Now, ideally, it'd be better to do without it, but I'm going to need to be extremely clever here. Today, the date is 2401-1793. Okay, 2401-1793. Do without the code? That's a lot. 
In the letters from the Pope, there are six letters just below the date, two just below the month, four others below the year. Piaget's tattoo, it must be used to establish a connection between the letter of the concentric circle and the number shown in the middle. Some figures are the same in both codes, yet they correspond to different letters. The day is not translated. That must be the key to the code. Okay, so no co what? No day? Some figures are the same in both codes, yet they correspond to different letters. The day is not translated. That must be the key to the code. Today the date is 2401-1793. Can't do these. Okay. 01-1793. Okay, so 01 there is EH. Because we're not doing doing it without the date. Without the month. I don't know. There's there's twelve right there. Which is G J. Okay. This is ridiculous. How do I do without the code? I mean, how how's that a thing? Okay. Well, it looks like I can't actually do it anymore, but I Let's go back to the logic of the code. That's not what I wanted to do. Oh, now I can go with that in there. In the letters from the Pope, there are six letters just below the date, two just below the month, four others below the year. Piaget's tattoo, it must be used to establish a connection between the letter of the concentric circle and the number shown in the middle. Letter, center of the circle, letter shown in the middle. I don't know. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. I, I don't know what to do. Okay, we know that it has a... I don't want to spend 10 points on the other thing. It'll leave me with one. I've... Could be E H H B C F. And that makes sense. Kind of. <laughs> 